scriptures talk about a blessedness that happens to a man whose delight is in the law of God. So as someone says, it says, but his delight is in the law of God. And doth he meditate day and night. He says that that man is like a tree planted by the rivers of water, whose leaves do not wither, when he bears fruit in every season. As you are about listening to this message, we believe that your life is going to be like that man planted by the rivers of water. Your leaves are forever going to bear. And we know that your, your season will not pass by. You will forever shine and you will forever bear fruit. We have a lot of content to share with you. So we would entreat you to subscribe to this channel as well as like us. Hit that notification bell to receive more updates from us because we know that whatever content here is going to set you on calls at every time. It's going to make you attain whatever stature that Christ wants you to attain. Thank you. We want to thank our leaders who, by the grace of God, are directing these meetings. And we thank our director, Jimmy Markin. And we thank our director, Apostle Dr. Jimmy Markin. For this opportunity that, we're together with his leaders, they've given us to share the word of God. I've worked with him for over 20 years. And through him, God has given me many benefits. Tonight is a night of restoration. May the Lord bless you, our sister. I had prayed to God before coming that, Lord, give me a confirmation. And through her, God brought a confirmation. And Lazarus, come out. Tonight, my team is a team of the convention that Lazarus, Come out. Lazarus, Sibra. Lazarus, come out. I would humbly plead for us to rise to our feet. Through this word, something is going to happen in your body. Something will happen in the spirit realm. Something will happen in your family. And something will happen in your life. When I say Lazarus, Fibra! Lazarus! Fibra! Lazarus! Fibra! Third one, you can Can Lazarus, I know I can say, come out. Lazarus, come out. Lazarus, come out. Put your hands together for Jesus. And you may, and you may, and you may, and you may, and you and you may, what is going to happen tonight is not what you are used to. And you may, 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 and Yesterday and the day before, we heard that there was a pool with many sick folk. Ah, yes, friend, Bethesda. I had a for the bread, go home. A do me beer or buffalo at the Hunu in Suno. It was a pool called Bethesda, and we heard that at a point, an angel will come and stir the water. It is somebody who said, I had a sub bar just in Subi. I was so. So if healing was going to come forth, there had to be a stirring of the waters. And 
So if you are going to hear that the lame was walking and the blind was seeing or the leper was cleansed, then there had been a stirring. Something spectacular. I said, what is going to happen tonight? It's not the usual. It's not what you are used to, but the spectacular and the extraordinary. Our elders have a proverb that if you see a dog standing up somewhere, then somebody lifted it. But I assure you that tonight you are going to see it and it's going to be by the power of the Holy Ghost. When Jesus comes, it's not the ordinary things that happen. By the pool, something happened. There was a day, there was no staring. There was no staring of the water. When Jesus Christ comes, there will not be a staring. The water will be quiet. But something happened. Hey! And you breathe. Tonight. Jesus has said Jesus has descended. There will not be a staring. But healing. But healing. I was asking myself. I was wondering as Jesus was conversing with that man, where were the others doing? Why wouldn't they look at Jesus and listen? All they are thinking was, there is no salvation from the back. There is salvation in the pool. That is what happens every day. But tonight, oh! what people were expecting that you had to use this means to get here, this is the drug you have to take to get well. And you mean God is going to give you a shortcut. He is going to do it just like that. Somebody whose leg is shortened will be stretched out. Because when Jesus descends, oh, the unusual and the extraordinary happens. We say that it is by a tree that the rope goes up. But tonight you'll see the rope by itself is going and there is no tree. It is not nobody else but you. She will climb up. Say a big amen. We shall read briefly from the gospel according to John chapter 11 from verse 37 to 43 Tidubaba Eye obo dain. Na obo anu ehini anu. Yesu kan se. Munyi obo anu. Diye wawonu enyamata se no se. E 
Awurade se se die wabon na wadi nanan Yesu se no se man kama nkira wo se wujidia ubehuru onyankopon eni onyam ene wo yi obuo no na Yesu ma na ni so e kan se eja me da wase se utie me na media min me se utie me da na nkrofo eku eku a wo gina ho no nti na me kan sa na wa gie di se wo na wo soma me na oka sa no odi ni kasi tie mu ka se lazaro fibra amen na odi eni kasi tie mu ka se lazaro lazaro fibra lazaro fibra hallelujah amen na ni awu wo nu e fri edi ai not just say, yeah, well, we'll know what to you. It means that the dead man heard. And that no more. And to my actual children in nine. And in in son. Now, do you actually children in him? Now, yes, you see one say. Mon son in no. Now, mama, no uncle. Hallelujah. Amen. Nanka ufuadiye ukasa wantiyo. A dead man doesn't hear you when you speak. Last year, last year, me ne me yere koye wa baby. My wife and I went to a funeral somewhere. Now what did that nipano? When they had laid the person in state. Abu Shiano nimse obi na kuno obi na kuno huhumu obi na aye ne dru kuno enti wakosi sikain wakoto sikain. Eh, a muru no wa cha no na wadi ashe. Eh, a muru nsa wampa no so. The family believed that somebody had killed a man in the spirit realm, so they had gone to buy a knife, a cutlass, and sharpened it and put it in his hand. Ne busi a peni no jina ho no kase a kia sekani a dia sha wunsa no. And the family head said, "A kia, this is a knife we've given you." Cut him. Then it would appear that the knife is falling off. They will push it back. I said, cut him into pieces. When we investigated, we saw that the people they were thinking killed the person had also come to the funeral. What the Akia to channel? They said cut into pieces. Akia cut into pieces. Niawa kanu Akia ente. What they were saying, Akia couldn't hear. Omo sa na mungu se wadi tume chawa wadi muno ashada kambi so wadi sika ni share ehu so wadi sika ni fini nzamu niokuwa ni nina no muno wante. Eventually, I saw that proceedings came to a close. They pulled down the cloth. Whether the dead person could hear or not. We don't know. But and you may but tonight. Yeah, we are talking about a man. Oh, when he speaks to a corpse. Oh, when he speaks to a corpse, oh, he hears. Hey. And you may be a way to chile. As you are standing at the back. So I was supposed to see I was so more. If you are deaf in the spirit, and now I saw me about in channel. Tonight the word that is coming to you. It created to me. It wields power. So what do I shall more? If you are in a pit, I saw me more who are doing. The power in the word. I bet you are. It will bring you out. I bet you are. It will bring you out. The one who could speak to a corpse. Hey. Now for the corpse to hear. Now and obey. Danuna Odinam. And we see a crime. 
The other day he was on a way to a cemetery. Na abrantie bia ya to ni din nay abrantie. A man called the gentleman of name. Na odini odini mame bakro. He was his mother's only son. Na wa wu and he had died. Na ya de no ko and they were taking him away. Now we share on Kwamu, and then he met them on the way. And Pepe no sasu no, say Obi wu sa na omu sunu no me di no Kwamu siya. Aya na be bring a new bring, ane ebia niyama kaka odia kong anunti no. We are so full of no one to boa. I just say Obi siya kwen siya. Sometimes when somebody dies like that, the people who carry him because of the drugs and other substances they've consumed, if you are not careful, they'll harm you. They don't listen to what you say. The Bible says when they met Jesus, he went and touched the casket. They couldn't move forward again. And you bring tonight. If something is carrying you away, if something is taking you to destruction, if something is taking you to your grave, Jesus will have it. Tonight, Jesus is here. He is going to touch your casket. If you are going to believe in Christ and take a step, you will not get to the cemetery. Yesterday we heard two witches. They had agreed and killed one of their children. When the second one saw it was her turn, she pushed him to go to the Church of Pentecost Crusade. She knows that when he gets there, his meat is now bitter. Oh, come, come, come. Say a big amen. Put your hands together for the gentleman. We see Abba. He's come already. We see Abba. He's already come out. Lazarus. Lazarus. Oh, man, you so cry. Lazarus. Come out. Lazarus. Come out. Amen. Amen. When Lazarus was sick and they informed Jesus, he delayed in going. So when he went there afterwards, Martha said, Oh, if you had been here, if you had come early enough, our brother, he wouldn't have died. In her mind, as I'm speaking, you can come. Because of the word we spoke, every chain is broken. Whoever is bound in the name of Jesus, we lose you. And you may make us say, "I know the American bar." As I'm speaking, come forth, come forth, come forth. No matter, I tell you, I am inside. Martha was thinking. Yes, in my eyes, I am too late. Jesus's coming was too late. And you may tonight. And catch it, cry. It's not too late. And now you're going with that. Today is a day of and grace. Now you're out. Today is a day of salvation for you. Wherever you struggle Jesus to, Jesus Jesus has stretched forth his hand. He's going to save you. Hallelujah. Amen. If you had been here, my brother would not have died. Oh, hallelujah. Amen. Yes, Jesus never makes a mistake. And he's never late. Crusade, this is the time. Elders, may the Lord bless you. The time God has appointed to save his people is today. The day God has appointed to get out of your things is today. Oh, hallelujah. Amen. 
And Jesus said, Lazarus, when they were discussing and they said Lazarus was sick, Jesus said that this sickness is not unto death. For the glory of God to be revealed. Maximum impact. Sometimes God takes his time to do something so that when he does it finally, it has maximum impact. So if you think you are broken beyond repair, today God wants to give you a surprise. And then he said, even if he dies he will rise again whoever believes in me he will never die but if he dies life it will be his oh hallelujah amen Martha really didn't comprehend it and Jesus said your brother he will be restored your brother will rise again. I know that in the last days we will all rise again. Jesus said it is today. I want you to understand tonight what God is going to do concerning you today and now. Hallelujah. Amen. Listen. Where did you lay him? And the Martha was telling him. Debbie. I didn't know. I say it is smelling. I did not know. It's been four days. Listen. When I was investigating, I saw in the tradition of the Jews, when somebody dies, his soul can hover around for three days. So if Jesus had come within that period while his soul was hovering around maybe he could push it into the body. And when Jesus saw the sticking he caused that three days to elapse so that they will give up. Tonight whoever has given up whoever's mind is destroyed whoever has a bad order when we say you have a bad order Sabi and yes no, it is not the type that you can smell with your nose. Something that smells is something that nobody wants to go to. When our brother Delali was testifying, his life was smelling. So even his father disowned him. The reason he was disowned when you go to a job and they disown you even in your marriage you are rejected in your family you are rejected in your community you are rejected it's been four days you are four days old there is an order around you nobody wants to get close but the God of this there is a man the one who smells he embraces him he takes him and baits him and dresses him up 
Now he gives a pleasant order. He gives a pleasant order. Hallelujah. Amen. Wabon. He was smelling. So Jesus waited for the three days to elapse for all their faith to evaporate. Their thinking was as for four days it cannot be it cannot be possible. His soul is gone. Tonight if somebody has told you this is your end we have brought one man what men have said he changes it I've already told you it is not the everyday occurrences you are going to see it is not the laid down procedure that we are going to follow Remember that water is not going to be stirred. Now, so I by. But there will be a healing. If the Jesus is because Jesus descended. And you mean what? Sorry, what? But tonight he's descended. Oh, hallelujah. Amen. Wabon. He was smelling. Woohoo, baby, what that? When they saw where he was laying, a boy and healing. And now no anno. There was a big stone at the mouth of the cave. The world is dark. One day I got a revelation. Saw so somebody who had been buried in a deep pit with a rock on top of it. When somebody tells you that this man has been put into a pit, you'll believe it. Now, but thanks be to God. And then today he's come out. Whoever hears my voice at the back, maybe they'll put you in a pit and put a big rock on top of it. And then today you'll come out. If only you believe and take a step, you'll come out. Hallelujah. Amen. And Jesus said, Roll away the stone. Now, let me ask you a question. Somebody's noble can die. And then we bury the person. And somebody comes and says, dig it up again. Is this something we do? We will not allow. But the voice that spoke wielded power. Tonight, if devils if bad families if they've gathered and they've decided where they've put you you will never prosper and they've stamped it tonight a voice is speaking tonight a voice is coming and the voice that is coming it wields power. Nobody can send it. The voice is called Jesus. Roll away the stone. I pray. Whoever hears my voice, if there is a stone on top of you, I stand in the mercy of God. We roll it away. Whether the devils like enemies like one pearl, or they don't like whether your family likes one pearl, or they don't like I will throw Jesus Jesus and because of his anointing I roll away every stone well, yes, Christ, oh, devil. in the name of Jesus Anna Aha Anna Mira now woko muribu ye na obi ye na oba oba na oba wa we me 
The reason Jesus said to roll away the stone, he has been accredited. He's been accredited as the only one who can speak to roll away the stone. No matter where you go, there is nobody who can roll away the stone in the spirit. There is no spirit and there is no religion that can roll away the stone. It is only Jesus who is accredited to roll away the stones from people's necks. Oh, hallelujah. Amen. When they rolled away the stone, when they rolled away the stone, Bible says, the Bible says, Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, he sounds out with a loud voice. The man who was rotten. I've already told you they gave somebody a knife. Akosia, Kunu, kill him. Akosia couldn't hold the knife. Yes, and they And then they put it in her hand again. Squeeze the hand on it. Akosia, I said, kill him. Omo kama niya. Omo kia yon se ono kunu. Omo kama niya. Akosia, I said, kunu. They were saying it for the person they were thinking killed her to hear. Akosia, kill him. Akosia, say. Akosia couldn't hear. If he said nipa and a kasa chile emu. Because it was a mere man speaking to the corpse, and the corpse could yeah, you mean, But tonight, Jesus, I mean, come for me. this Jesus we are recommending to you, when he speaks to a corpse, he hears. Hey, hey. The Bible says. The Bible says. Lazarus, our pro. The Lazarus who was rotten. Lazarus, our bone. The Lazarus who was smelling. Was sorry. He arose. Wonderful. Hey, mwa, mwa. Lazarus, come out. Lazarus, come out. Was sorry. He arose. I say, I sorry, we are here. When he got up, his hands were bound. His legs were bound. His face was bound. There are many people walking about in the spirit. They are bound. Their legs are bound. So you cannot move forward. When you examine your life, you can see that you are trying your best. But there is no progress. And you mean tonight. Because we recommend Jesus to you. When you come to him, he will lose your leg. And you can walk. Hallelujah. Amen. His legs were bound. So he couldn't walk. And he has received life though. saying, How is your life? Somebody says, Mrs. Watcher. I started a long time ago. But I don't see any progress. Tonight we brought progress. Your legs are bound. Jesus, was Jesus is here to lose you. Hallelujah. Amen. He says his hands are bound. In the spirit. You see your hands are bound like that. Maybe your hands are bound in the spirit. Whatever you touch doesn't do well. Whatever you do doesn't work. 
Only one man is the accredited to speak for you to be free. The third one is so pathetic. He says his face was bound with a cloth. Our brother Delali said, at a time he was jumping over invisible holes. But there were no holes. When he tries to move, he sees the road winding. His face was bound. He couldn't see where to pass. Because he bound your face, you are hitting your head against the wall. Jesus said, Lose him and let him go. Put your hands together for Jesus. Jesus Christ said, Jesus said, Lose him. Lose him and let him go. Whoever hears my voice, and then you do, this is your day. If you don't come, your face may be bound. You don't see where to pass. Wherever you hear my voice, the man Jesus is here. He has anointed us to lose you and let you go. Say a big amen. Your face is bound. He was jumping over invisible holes. But I believe where there's a hole, if there's really a hole, he will see that one as level ground. So he will put his foot there. That he's putting it on a flat land and he'll fall into the pit. Because his face is bound. Tonight, Whoever faces bound, Jesus, Jesus is calling you. Now, and he's anointed us yes, to lose you Nako. and let you go. Oh, hallelujah! Amen. Jesus is passing this way. This way. Oh, this, this way. way. Jesus is passing this way. Oh, he's passing this way right now. Oh, Jesus is passing this way. talking about. He was asking this Jesus you're talking about you said in the days of the apostles somebody who has died and gone why, why is he today why is it that today you are still talking about him Hebrews <laughs> chapter 13 and verse 8 Hebrew for Homa, it's a dummy and sons, it's a moon watch. I say, Yes, to Christo, Jesus Christ, what is the same yesterday, what is that, and today, what is that, and forever. There's nobody on the earth, what is that, who is like that yesterday. There are many great names that have come into the nation and have gone. E X X. Now the account post, you know. We add E X to your post. We can enter P I O because immediate pass. It's okay. If it's not been too long, we say immediate pass. Not just said yeah. Or call you enter. We post. We are did it. Did it. Did it. Did it. Did it. Did it. Your post is already gone. Eka Christi former. 
And then we say former. Some people say they won't leave so that they become ex, immediate past, and former. I'll continue to be there. So no matter what you do, I'll be there. I, be, I remember we were in a certain nation. It was about the time for the elections. The booth in which you are supposed to cast your ballot secretly, there was a soldier with a gun. And then when you go, he shows you, this is where to stamp. And woe betide you. And then stamp somewhere else. You are going to fall over there. So when we finished, ninety-eight percent. Ninety-eight percent. He doesn't want to be X. If you don't want to be X, former and former. RTD. And you don't want RTD retired. We beg you late. You'll be late. No, and you believe. But tonight, but I'm be sorry. a man arose. <laughs> The Bible says in the fullness of time God sends a son born of a woman. 33 years. He was 33 years old. He died. Nobody can call him immediate past. Nobody can say the former Jesus. Jesus retired. Nobody can say Jesus retired. You cannot say late Jesus. He is called Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. But you are to say Jesus. You are to say Jesus. Jesus Christ the same. Yesterday, today, and forever is mine. Oh, yes, is mine. Jesus Christ of yesterday, today, and forever is mine. Oh, yes, is mine. Oh, and you may have been in the apostle Wakanum, a Kwasanka, a Bogosun, and near to. When we used to go with Apostle Walker to Bogotá to preach, we used to sing the song. Yahweh Shiloh. May the Lord bless you. He is the same Jesus of yesterday. When there are some people, when they stamp on your letter and they sign it, it is whole, complete. But when he leaves the seat, go and give it to him to sign. It will not work. No, it's not going to work. That is what disturbs some people. I can no longer sign. Your time is past. It's better for you to go and find a place to rest. Otherwise, you'll be a ghost hovering around. You are good for nothing. But the Jesus we are talking about, he died about 2,000 years ago. But today, when we mention his name, miracles happen. He's still saving. He's still making people better. He's still speaking to us. He's the Jesus of yesterday. Jesus. Sorry, Kakia. Jesus.
Philippians chapter 2 and verse 9. Philip before whom I it seemed me a new inch a moon chrono. Because of this, God has given him a name that is above every name. Yes, in the name of Jesus, every that's the body now. When we mention the name, those in heaven, as I see so, and yes, as I see, when you know, Bible can say, Jesus, Jesus is Lord, Jesus, oh, you're right, Jesus is Lord. So wherever you are, and now you're double down. This is a day of grace. And now you're going to die. It's a day of salvation. So America, run, 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 run over here. Now, what shall you say? And sunny when you're ready. For he has anointed us. Why the Abba Jesus is coming? Who is coming to Jesus? Yes, we are turning sunny when you're ready. Jesus has stretched forth. Why the Abba? Who is coming? To America, to America, to America, to America. Run over now, here. Salvation will be yours tonight. Yeah, Run over here. When the Abba, who is coming? When the Abba, who is coming? As we're gonna sing. Wherever you're standing. Baby, wherever you're standing. Baby, wherever you're standing. Help them. Put your hands together for those. Baby, you wherever you're standing. Oh, Lazarus, Fibra. Lazarus, come out. Bra, 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 bra. Come, 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 bra. come. Don't be afraid, don't be shy. If you're running to Jesus, it is glory. There's no sign. What is sign? What is good to be sign? Is to go and steal. Now To be caught. But when you come to Jesus, it is victory. Sorry. Rise Let us rise. Bring them. Yes. Bring God bless you. God Bring bless them. you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. In Oh, <laughs> 
Lazarus, <laughs>
And then they only know at one quarter more pie. As for today, you have nothing to do with him. Yen ye ye ruano. As for us, our Lord. But yen kwa heaven. He's taking us to heaven. And yen mo amo aji Christo edi mo abayi no. Beloved, we have come to Christ. And then heaven, e ye mukrum. Today, heaven is your home. Amen. Go also pa. Amen. I'm rasi mo mo be sorry. Please rise to your feet. Does everybody understand chi? Won't teach you ya. Te ya won't say. Ya ba bo ka se bia wo ka no. Christo aye a sorry a dum ka se bia e bi wa ha. Whatever language you speak. Bon sama emrante ya e be bon sama on. Push your hands together for the gentleman. Hey. You see the coordinator your future wo. Wow. Bonsam, bonsam, my Jesus. Oh, put your hands together for Jesus. Obia tichui waha. Okay. Pamu chau mum peja munsa mienu. Please lift up your two hands. Na asema mi babe kenu. And what I'm going to say. Si wakume mu pa na ka na fe chidi tejri ne ne onyango pong obesi sangu shebre. Say it from the bottom of your heart. And back it with faith, and today God will change your destiny. Yes, bro, good. Come, come, come. come. Mumra mechi and quencio Mumra 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 Jesus. Put your hands together for Jesus. God let your name go. Have a chance, Mr. Munsa. Please lift up your hands. I know it's just a woman, but you to me, ma. It doesn't mean you cannot. Asaba meke kedi mechi. Say what I'm saying after me. Another day. Today. Another day. Me chidi se. Yesu Christo oyo nyankopon ba Yesu Christo aye onyankopon ba Me bonin ti ana obewui Na sa obebu bi bim ti ana onyane no fi awufu Enti enna me fa ne ya mi wura Me fa ne ya mi wura kaniye and me kira ajen kwa me shabo se me ninu ba nante me kwa ne nyina eti awrade boa me anti fo nyina nti mu ka men ka sienwu om so e amen yen san ka ba kon ka ho e amen enya bi en sai amen ya ba sra osumafo bo achi aja ko no, I'll be shame by Bob. A good Musu Samri. I'm rather moving in our sorry. And fire home and tell fire. Yes, my for a boy. Hello, beloved in Christ. We hope this message was a blessing to you. I would want you to do something for us. If you are new here, kindly hit on that subscribe button for us and then like this video as well. Share to your family and friends to bless them because we know that this message will be a blessing to their body, to their soul, and to their spirit. We would need you to do one thing for us too. Tell us in the comment section where you were watching us from. And if you've got any testimony for us, kindly share with us. Thank you for watching.